<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the Journey YouTube channel. On this channel, you don't know talk about spirituality, self empowerment, and all of them things there. So, yeah, I watch the year, guys. I just watch my year and all of them things there. And it made for it. Breeze out. Anyways, welcome back. Today, we're going to talk about the 144,000 um, light workers um, that came to earth in this time. It was predicted, it even in the Bible, honestly. They have, have a version right in the Bible that was talking about 144 saints. And yada yada yada. 144,000 saints. So, and the same thing, the rapture that I spoke about in the last video was talking about the 144,000 saints that were gonna be, you know, risen up, you know consciously not physically in consciousness you know so they might get like a spiritual upgrade so that is what is happening in earth right now you know that's why so much conjunctions are um, if you check this um heavens the lunar events them where um a lot of eclipse um you know recently in the past years so that's for sure you say something really and truly um just check it you know, check what well, happened. Same like Jesus did say. If it seems like how you can predict say the rain has come, the rain is about to fall. You know, you can feel that there is a change happening right now. You know, unless you don't in tune. You know, I mean, know that most of the people in tune right now. Because the change happened, the call happened, and most of the answer, answer the call, you know, and most of the way I do with duties, you know, most of the way I wake up. Most of the way I try to seek and find out what really happened. I try to find out, you know. Just people just are seek, people are trying to find answers in at this time and that is what the age of Aquarius brings to. You know, people seeking knowledge. And the age of Aquarius brings teachers, people who share the knowledge, people who seek the knowledge, acquire the knowledge and share it and spread it and that is what we do here do. So the 144,000 now light workers, these are beings from other dimensions, beings that are evolved more spiritually um, uh, than <laughs> way more spiritually than earth beings. You know, we in a region no way in our evolution yet, we just their third dimension. These beings I'm tell you about now exist from the sixth dimension to wherever to you know further on further on because at the sixth dimension I have a video may I explain the dimension but just bear with me right here so so there are dimensions of existence right the beings earth is shifting from a three dimension earth right now currently this existence this reality is a three dimensional reality you know and it's shifting from a 3D reality to a 5D reality so earth is going through a shift right now that is why everything has shut down the whole Covid, da 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 da, all of that, you know, all of this bang bang boom is all about that. The shift. We are going to, a, we are going, going through a shift, a change. You get what I say? So a rise in consciousness. Certain bullshit we say I'm right now will cease to exist in the future. Believe me. In the near future too. Just check it. You know, it's the same like what them say the apocalypse and certain things just shut down and. That is what we are going to experience, but they are trying to make it slow. They don't want to just throw it on the people, them, so, you know, because you don't want to get the people them scared. I think that they might think. <laughs> Whatever, but nevertheless, we're going through it the same way. And the 144,000 are here. A lot of them are here. I teach on YouTube, all over the internet, TikTok, all over the spirit, all over the place. Black people, Hispanic people, a lot of white people too, you know, because we incarnate in all different races because we are one, you get what I say? So the 144,000 coming in all different races because it's unity we are dealing with. So we are trying to bring white, black, pink, yellow, purple, everybody together. You know, so we are going to incarnate in only one race. So I dimension of being we have free will, we can incarnate as even dogs, we can incarnate as white, we can incarnate as black, we can choose, you get what I say? We all know that the melanated body is the most powerful body and most of we choose to incarnate in the melanated bodies. Hence, 
whatever I'm about to tell you now. The 144,000, that number is significant because that number 144 um, uh, equals 9, and 9 is the highest spiritual number, the highest karmic number. That number is not the, uh, that is not the only amount of spiritual people that are going to be here in this time, but we need at least that you know amount of spiritual enlightened people to bring the consciousness of earth beings to the next level so that's why the bible spoke about 144,000 that's why right now may i explain it more 144,000 is just symbolic to a nine to nine which means a, a wicked spiritual change and a higher spiritual change transformation which is what the earth is going through right now sorry you know, the earth is going through right now from 3D to 5D to make a massive spiritual shift, a shift in consciousness, you know. It raises our, earth has raised our vibration and we are, we are held powerful to do it by spreading knowledge, by bringing peace, you know. And with peace comes more trees because we are got conscious, so we don't have to cut down the tree them because of them are keep we alive. And you know, the earth has got change completely, little by little, you know, but it has got happen. So, just prepare for it and yeah, I want for things, you know, about to come, I'm speak about it because it really and truly the close. <laughs> like so the 144 light workers now are being from higher dimensions that have incarnated into earth at this time to aid in the shift from 3D to 5D consciousness. That is what it's about. So we are helping raise the consciousness on earth, trying to raise the vibration of the people, trying to spread love. And unity and all of them things there. And we are trying to end the slavery and the old ways of thinking. And, and uh, you know, I think that God is one local man in our sky. We don't deal with that. We are dealing with God from the inside. God that is the highest version of ourselves. God is, you know, that is God. So, yeah, that's about that. And big up the Journey YouTube channel once more. Stay tuned for more. You know, we have lots more to come. So, just stay tuned. Big up.